Okay, today we're going to see how a first flush diverter, otherwise known as a roof washer, can be built out of just regular old PVC pipe. So this is, uh, right here is the adapter, it's a 4 inch to 2 inch. This is a 2 inch, 2 inch and a half. Now this is an inch and a half to inch and a quarter adapter, but as you can see, I've ground the edges off. So these two are the same basically without this. Okay, you'll see why in a minute. This is an inch and a quarter piece of pipe with a bevel on it on the inside. Doesn't have to be a lot, just enough for the ping pong ball to seat in it. That's what's going to seal it. Okay, that's why we cut a bevel in there. You don't have to do that, but it's going to make a little bit better seal if you do. Now, this and this are the same thing. This is two inch to inch and a half again. Now it's, it's two inches on the outside here. Now this is a two inch threaded adapter, so it, it fits in like that, okay? This is a piece of inch and a half pipe. That fits right in here like this. Now it's kind of loose, so you're gonna have to glue that. We'll, we'll, we'll go over that later too, okay? That's just inch and a half PVC, and this is an inch and a half slip cap, which goes over the end of that. There'll be holes drilled in this. We're gonna show you how to do that. It'll be a couple holes in the bottom here. Now, here's how it goes together. First of all, we got the four inch to two inch adapter. Now, since this is a two inch to inch and a half, it fits in like that. Uh, that's a, we're gonna make that go all the way down. But right now, I don't want it to go all the way down. Otherwise, I won't be able to get it apart. Now, here's that other adapter that I changed. See, this adapter will normally fit like that, but we gotta have this off of here. So, on the other diverter that I showed you, prior in another video I actually cut this in half that really isn't the best thing to do just grind the edges off then it fits in like that okay then your quarter inch pipe is going to go inside there because this is inch and a half to uh, inch and a quarter sorry not quarter inch but inch and a quarter in like that now this is going to fit over the outside of this adapter that's how we ground those things off like that goes like that now since this is a two inch and this is two inch on the outside it fits on like that now this pipe slides inside of there. Now that's, that's the one part we're going to glue. That's the only part we're going to glue. Now, before we put this together, we just drop the ping pong ball in. And because of that pipe in there that we had, that we beveled, the ping pong ball does not go through. It creates a seal. Now we put the slip cap on the bottom to keep the ball from falling out. And that's it. Well, that's basically the part of the diverter that does the diverting. What it does is, there will be holes in this pipe here, be holes down here. So as water comes in here, it just goes in there and just fills up the barrel. When the barrel fills up, the water comes up like this. And as soon as it reaches here, then it starts inside this pipe, filling the pipe. And that makes the ping pong ball float. And it floats up as the water fills. When it gets to right here inside there, it seals. And this fills up and the fresh water flows out. And by the time you've filled a 55 gallon barrel, you've washed a lot of roof. So that's how this thing works. We'll look at the rest of it a little bit later.